All right, let's go for Isaac to Dogma. Here we go. Turn my volume down, it's loud. <coughs> Obviously we're starting with the D6. Hope for, let's hope for good items. Hmm, it's pretty good early on, I would say. Um, I'm not gonna waste any bombs yet. What the? Well, now I might. That was a weird room. We gotta find super secret first, just in case there's any kind of item in there. Well, hard up there. Bunch of batteries. Oh, that's good to see. Um, we got two keys, so let's open this gold chest. Get that. And that. And right, we get our key back. No soul heart yet. Soul converter. All right, we could roll that. Let's go see what the boss has. Get our good friend Plum, or whatever this guy's name is. I actually do want to break these poops, I think. I think they're going to get in the way when he does like this kind of attack. Man, he was scooting right there. That snipe was actually crazy. I don't really care if we take too much damage in here because I think there was like two. Wow, that was a. Wait, that took a whole heart, huh? Okay. So I guess his random big shots. Dude, is this guy gonna kill me here? Okay, hold yourself there. Hold yourself. Yeah, I guess his big shots must take a whole heart. Three bombs. So we could we could look for magic mush if we really wanted to. Maybe we can find a sacrifice room up here. Starting off starting off pretty rough here. There is a sacrifice room at least. We just need to not get hit by another champion. Let's go in here first. A random soul heart. Sun and justice. Um, we should come get the soul heart before we leave. If we remember. Let's play this room out a bit here. Really? Not a single payout. That was like five hits. Okay. We could have rolled the boss item. But I think Crackjacks is fine. The Holy Grail? <clears throat> well, we have that now. What else can we get from the that room? We can get money or we can get... So we, have, we still have two Soul Hearts on the floor. We can still get money from here. Or we can get that. What is that? That's a new item. Keep the flame burning. The tears up, unless maybe something hits it, I'm guessing. Troll bombs.
Sorry about that. No, we're not fighting that guy. <clears throat> Alright, so we got the money, not the soul hearts, unfortunately. That's okay, we have a lot of money. Take that. And then we'll pick up the other soul heart on the way out of here. Oh, we have flying, that's right. Um, we could use some bombs, just to see. I still haven't seen magic mush yet. Actually, we don't even need bombs, so... May as well blow them all up. Ooh. Down here. Get ghost pepper, which... Or is that dog tooth? I can't ever remember. I think let's roll it. Because we have all those batteries, and we don't really need that. Even if it was Dogtooth, we already know where all our secret rooms are because of uh, whatever it is that we have here. X-ray specs. Real quick, was there a battery in here? No. What's this card? Case of clubs. And turn stuff into bombs. <clears throat> let's roll this again. Yeah, I think that's Scorpio, right? Poison Tears. It's pretty good. And what else did we have? There's nothing over there, nothing in there other than... I think we just roll these into bombs. Blow up the other set of mushrooms and then go. Maybe get mini mush. And shot speed down. What else is in here? Just another bomb. Soul converter. I think we're good. We'll go to downpour one. Oh, I didn't even see that guy. We do not want that. Let's bomb one of these and the guy. I'll keep the other one for now. We're getting a tears up every room we clear here. I'm assuming that has something to do with this. Let's take question marks. Uh, it's not bad. Yeah, just more damage, I guess. It's not a great item, but still more damage. Oh, uh, I finally went out. So it looks like we're gonna get a tears up every room until the candle goes out. Um, that's kind of dumb. All that does is activate your space bar item if you take a hit. I'm hoping that that only goes out if you take a hit, not if the candle itself gets hit. Go in here first. Death. Ooh, okay. I'm all the void. That's pretty good, I would say, but I th think we can do better. It's not as good as it used to be. Let's roll this stuff. Yeah, I would say this stuff's a little better. I is probably better than all the void just because it's passive. And I think we just fight the boss with this idiot. Nice. <laughs> and we can probably take that other item too. What was it? It was Bloody Lust, right? 
Uh, is it worth? Yeah, I think it's worth. So every time we take a hit now, we're going to get a damage up. And nothing else in here. We already cleared the item room. Just go clear the floor at least. Yeah, cheat death in here, no big deal. Uh, I'm not gonna go in the cursed room. I'm gonna keep the soul heart. That shot is something else, man. What a shot. Range up. Any tenants in here? Ooh, that's a good pickup to find. need you listen I think we're gonna roll that see if we get a good one and if not we'll just take the question mark Is that farting baby or something triple shot could be fun Especially with Aya Belial. Didn't I kill something? Oh, these little guys. Ooh, a bunch of red hearts. Wasn't there a demon beggar? This is going to be a little lengthy, but it's going to be worth it. I'm gonna be safe about this because I don't know if it would take us down or if it would eat our soul heart up. How many are in here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven more. So seven more trips back and forth. Oh, okay. We got teleported. Are we cursing the maze? I think we're cursing darkness. Oh, I just walked in the wrong door. Never mind. Okay, that's fine. Okay. We're gonna get we're gonna just continue to stockpile damage though. Because of bloody lust. You know what, let's actually go into this store real quick. All right, there, that's good. Might as well buy that and buy the sack because it's half off. And now we'll test out to see if we can go all the way down to zero and make this go a little bit faster. We should be able to. Moon card. Just teleports us to a secret room. Which we don't need, but we can keep it for teleportation just out of the uh out of the depths if we need to. We're gonna get a payout from you. Whether you want us to or not, we're getting one. There we get two more, two more tries. 
Maybe not even that. Might keep this health for the boss just to be safe. Thank you. That wasn't so hard now, was it? Moon or Empress? Let's keep Empress. We don't really need Moon. Uh, might as well just go get our heart back. Just in case we take big boy damage. Searching time. And let's fight the boss. And he's dead. That's gonna give our make our tears bigger. It's actually pretty good, I think. Yeah, because now we basically have this whole front. They have no they have no spread between them. Let's go full clear the floor just to um, make sure we didn't miss anything. We could fight that boss again, actually. Let's do it. We don't need the knife piece, though. With this kind of damage, we should... Oh, where did we go to? That was weird. Yeah, easy. There's a tears up, too. It's actually huge. Yeah, I think let's just go back and let's just get out of here. Hey guys, pretty good. We could even pay that guy out again, but I think we would die as the lost, right? Ooh, but we could just go roll this room, couldn't we? Since we don't need the key piece, can we just go roll it? Ooh, you baby! good here we have really good really good stats now yep we'll leave a trinket behind somewhere we should do it on this floor we don't really need stud finder Nice to see. We're going to be searching for magic mush now. Here's down. Oh my god, we ate the trinket. Hopefully there's a guaranteed trinket drop on that floor. Probably shouldn't have taken that eternal heart yet. Okay, this room could be good. Ooh, is that a... That's one of the other ones. What does this do again? Let's pop it.
Okay, I just used like six pills from one temperance card. Did we get a drowsy pill? Looks like we did. What is this? Something's wrong. Another golden bomb. It's a weird run. I like it. Heck, X triple shot. What? All right, all we're looking for now is a trinket. Didn't donate. We don't really need any money anymore. Oh, I like how this still procs I have Blile too. Let's go back to our arcade and just get more money. Okay, that gives us the big damage boost. There's our trinket. I also like how when we were hitting that donation machine, it actually moved the uh, eternal heart back to the older, um, older heart container. So that's gonna be harder to lose it now. Not like I think we're in any kind of danger now that we have tech X, but. And now all these shot speed downs are actually buffs because tech X is gonna stay on its target longer. Right, let's see what the boss gives us. Maybe we get a devil deal. That'd be huge. Oh, actually, we're going to take that one. We'll leave this one behind. Yeah, that was pretty free. No devil deal. Sad day. All right, so we'll leave this trinket behind. Take Mr. Dollage because it is more tears and soul hearts. And then we'll go pick up the goat. Goat hoof and go. Eh, that's fine. All right, let's use Degas because I don't feel like dealing with Curse of the Lost. Actually terrible. Two items from in here, huh? You know what's crazy is I don't think we need any of those. So now we have two items to roll. Yeah, let's roll them. All right, we'll touch this and this. But yeah, we don't need any of that. We're pretty much max on HP. We don't need more tears because we have tech X. There's our fool card for the next floor, apparently. We just have to not make the mistake and go to the womb like we did last night. Fine. Get yeah, have it. It's pretty good. Take it. Um, let's buy the soul heart as well.
And now let's head back to our other spot. What do we have here? Her throw, even more. Okay. This is good. We should get a few rolls here. Get Sack Dagger. 120 volts, pretty good, too. Uh, let's take both of those, actually. Because we're always going to be holding down the fire button. Now we're just looking for, we need to go get our fool card still. Now we're just looking for the item room so that we can roll that. But honestly, we may even just go roll the devil deal at this point. Might be a better roll. Oh my God, what are all these items? Just getting items everywhere. Gonna be up here. Oh, that was the bomb guy. That's a pretty funny room. There we go. There's our item room. Yeah, we'll take euthanasia. That's pretty good, actually. Probably the boss, right? not <clears throat> um yeah let's just go back grab our fool card on the way We're gonna get exactly enough for a charge at the boss room because of that room. That's awesome. Yeah, we're pretty strong. We don't even need that. And it's Krampus. And he's dead. I will touch it just to touch it. But let's roll it. Ooh. We're using that for sure. <clears throat> we get mom's knife. Uh, <clears throat> I don't think we want that. We definitely don't need Judas's shadow because we've already we've already done the dark room as Judas or not the dark room the um the beast fight as Judas. I feel like mom's knife is gonna break our tech X and tech X is better. So yeah, I'm just gonna leave that. We will take this and up to two. Here we go. I don't even know what we lost. Did we keep our candle? Yeah, we kept our candle. That was the only thing I even cared for anyways. Oh yeah, we can break those because euthanasia. mod uh i don't know yet we'll see we could take him i mean just free help basically in here
Ten room. Alright, so there's our final room. We will go there last, because we were, you know, that's our thing now, is we fool card out and we instantly go down, because otherwise we'll forget, and we'll end up going to the freaking womb. Acid, baby. Alright, so let's go back to the store, just donate the rest of our money, because we have... We have a bunch. Let's get some more damage, make this fight easier. I think we're at the max. Hey, we had habit too. We can go roll acid baby now. Thanks spider mod guy. And let's just uh, donate everything back. Oh, big donations. We're back at 720 now. That's huge. I've pulled from that machine more in Repentance than I think I did in all of Rebirth. make one final stop after this fight. Oh, wow. Um, yeah. Alright, do not go to the womb. Also, don't go that way. <laughs> I want to min-max my shop just to keep feeding that donation machine. And now that we have Polaroid, we can play the blood donation machine. We should be able to play it a lot, because we should get Polaroid invincibility. Wow. That's pretty good. And now we can roll IV bag. I don't know what that does. Seems nice. All right, we can buy the battery and roll the finger up in the um, item room. Actually pretty good unless the shot speed down all right to the dark path we go go. What is this room? Oh, they're back. I definitely don't want to take a hit. I want to keep my A plus card here. The bedroom? that. <laughs> it's a clean bedroom too. Is that bomb going to stay there? Is 
What do we got down here? Even more damage, okay. A lot more damage, too. Um, honestly, I may roll the quarter. Let's find the item room, for, or the shop first. We don't need to get any more powerful, but it would be nice still. Got a soul heart, too. All right, well, we found the boss room, which is going to be the, uh, the dad's note. So let's keep exploring. I there was a soul heart in here. Did it not? Like we're wasting some charges. We could have rolled that quarter already. But you never know. The shop could have something insane. Not likely in this game, though. Wait, was there no shop? Oh, it's to the right. But the shop and the item room are connected over there. bank now let's just pay it back we can go get the quarter and pay it back too if it doesn't break all right there we go finally broke it all right let's just go let's just finish off the run here should be a pretty free uh Free dogma fight and pretty free um, beast fight as well with this build. Especially because anytime we take damage, we're just going to get insane stats. I spent it. It's gone. Just get over it. You mean it's gone? How can you have spent our savings? There goes the lucky card. I don't even know what hit me there, to be honest. Nod Leaf. Nod Leaf Sack Dagger is a guaranteed win, so yeah, we'll take that. Up we go. Oh, you know what? There's our cracked key piece in there. We can just go grab it. What trinket did we even leave behind? Or is that one that just may have spawned in the boss room? Must have. Random crawl space. Do not need that stuff. I guess I should at least check that card in case it's a higher font. Higher font, have you said? It's the fool. Up we go. No, I don't want to do that card. There's another cracked key. Oh, that was a new attack. I don't think I've seen that one before.
get a battery. I don't think we even left anything behind either, so we can't roll anything. Man, that should have never hit me. All right, all right. <laughs> let's let's stop taking stupid damage. bombs. Oh wow, that again. That's such a good item. Oh, I know why we lost our trinket. It's because we had that, um, the freaking report card or whatever that thing's called. And we took a hit, so we broke. soul hearts when it matters the most. Can we get more? Worth a shot. Should be our up room right here. I guess like one more over. Blow this guy up. I could have actually just rolled there, probably. We should be unlocking Painted Isaac now. More tears up? I'm gonna give us Soul Hearts back, I guess, so we might as well take it. Yeah, tears up is not even, there is actually no tears up from that. Let's go up here and use our, uh, use our cracked key. Painted Isaac unlocked. This flies, right? <clears throat> All right, final boss time. Gotta watch this because if you don't watch this, you always take damage. Hopefully, they'll patch that. Still almost took damage there, too. Might be the strongest run I've had in Repentance so far. Definitely really powerful.
We almost got hit by that one. Alright, we know hit dogma. That's pretty good. Time for the beast. Isaac versus the beast. Try to no hit this guy. Ooh, that was a close one. All right, one down. Should be able to no hit this pretty easy. We have insane damage right now. The only one I'm worried about is death. War shouldn't be too bad. He does have that sketchy bomb throw though. Oh, he cracked our shield. No. Technically, we're still no hit, right? He cracked our holy mantle, but we haven't taken heart damage. Oh, there's our first hit. Oh, that actually made our tears right bad too, because it hurt our, um, whatever it is, our candle. But we're going to get the beast kill here. Oh, whoops. I'm just standing there like a moron. Isaac versus the Beast, complete. ascended towards the crack in the sky, and as he flew, he could see echoes of his past before him. He saw his mother mourning the loss of her son. He saw his father leaving them without turning to say goodbye. He saw his mother sleeping, and his father taking money from her purse. He heard the late night fights they had that kept him up at night, and the guilt he felt for what he believed he was causing. He felt the pain in his stomach during those sleepless nights and saw his shadow in the closet waiting for him. 
As he rose, he felt his fears drop from his body, his shame, his worry pulled from his being. As he became lighter, his ascent became faster. He saw his one true companion alive and well. He saw his mother and father together again, holding each other. He felt his mother kissing him on the head after he had said his prayers, and the comfort in knowing someone was watching over him. He saw his own birth, and the faces of his parents filled with joy and optimism. And then he saw nothing. Are you sure this is how you want this story to end, Isaac? You're the one writing it. It doesn't have to end this way. Here, how about we tell it a different way? Maybe a happy ending? Okay, Daddy. Good. Are you getting sleepy yet? Yeah. Okay, so... <clears throat> Isaac and his parents lived in a small house. 